Hi, Don Catalano here from I Optimize Realty. We're here in beautiful Greensboro. It's a sunny day. We're at the Honda Jet factory and service center with our beautiful Honda Jet. Boy, the Honda people know how to take care of that plane. They know how to build it. I was just here for simulator training, did four hours in the simulator yesterday, practicing every kind of emergency. We train at the same level as airline pilots twice a year. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. We have tons of video we post every day, tips that will save you money on your corporate real estate and some fun things like us flying the plane. So we'll maybe take a video on the way back to New York. Honda just completed four hours of great sim training yesterday. We'll be doing a start up here. Okay, that's the stick shaker. Checking our switches straight up and down. Everything is in normal mode. Checking our lights, all good. Checking our Pause switches. Pause system test, okay. Oxygen is on, gonna test the oxygen. Gonna load our flight plan. And while we're at it, we're gonna listen to ATIS. Mission contact. You have information, Foxtrot. Information, Foxtrot. Now let's call for clearance. Greensboro clearance, Honda Jet 430 Delta Charlie at Honda Jet Service Center with information, Foxtrot. Ready, copy, clearance. Honda Jet 430 Delta Charlie, Greensboro. Cleared to Farmingdale Airport via the Quaker 7 departure. Richmond transition, then it's filed. Maintain 5,000, expect audible 370 10 minutes after. Departure frequency 126.6, squawk 5777. And Honda Jet uh, 430 Delta Charlie understands it's the Quaker uh, 7 uh, departure, Richmond, then has filed uh, 5,000 initial altitude, flight level 370 and 10. Departure frequency be 126.6, score code 5777. Honda Zero Delta Charlie, be back, correct. And uh, which runway will I be assigned? You're at Honda, correct? At the service center, yes. I uh, expect 2-3 left. 2-3 left, thank you. Have that set. Departure, two, one, three one, left. left. All right, we'll go get these guys waiting for me, so I'm gonna get started here. Yes. Starting engines, okay. Fuel is plentiful, voltage is good. Okay, negative cast messages, okay. Parking brake is set. Look for oil pressure, have oil pressure. Uncage the engine, we're in our start sequence right here. Okay, that's good. Okay, for oil pressure. Uncaged it. Okay, two good lights. Okay. Signaling to uh, move the external power. Go ahead and set my flaps. Flight controls will be the next thing. Do speed brake. Guys at Honda are terrific. Did weight balance, not going to do takeoff data. We, uh, pull down the weather by just tapping on that. It pulls the weather from the satellite, which is just dandy. So we got our winds, our temperature, our barometric pressure. I've already set my barometers. Okay, pitch trim is gonna be set to four. Okay, we're gonna have a headwind of one knot and a right crosswind of 13 knots, not too bad. It's a toga button, I br brought the uh, flight director up and I'm going to go ahead and accept that and then you'll see the information post there. I did. And uh, let's just look at the flight plan. Annual sequence, Greensboro, Genie to Richmond. Okay, beautiful. Flight time should be, once we take off, about an hour. Let's get the frequency set up and the squawk code moving right along. So squawk code first, 5777. Seven, seven. Interesting tidbit of history. That was developed in World War II as a friend or foe identifier. So the friendlies would shoot down the friendlies and it's carried over to this day. I use that to identify who you are, what speed you're going, pretty much everything they need to know about your plane. Okay, so that's our departure frequency. We got 5,000. We're expecting, I cross things off as I'm done, 37,000 feet or flight level 370 and 10. So we have our departure frequency 26.6, our score code 5777. And tower will be standing by. And now I'll make a quick hard turn. As this plane can and can do. Watch how, how 
that pivots nicely. There we go. This plane could turn on a dime. And I'll be speaking to ground here. Got two microphone buttons, one here, one behind the, the left side of the yoke. Greensboro ground, Honda Jet 430 Delta Charlie at the Honda Jet service, now ready to taxi to 23 left. Honda 430 Delta Charlie, Greensboro, runway 23 left, taxi via Mike. 5 Mike, 23 left, 0 Delta Charlie, thank you. I like to say thank you. If it's not too, too busy, you know, just to show courtesy. Hard work and professionals, air traffic control. Everybody, uh, Everybody that flies that doesn't take a train or a car depends upon them and their professionalism, as well as the pilots. So it's a team effort. So uh, I have total respect for them. All right, so I'm taxiing on Mike, a very short little taxiway, and I'll be up, up, and away. Okay, go through my checklist. Flaps are set for takeoff. They are. Trim is set. I don't know if you can see this on the left side. Speed brake is retracted. Negative cast messages. Cast is crew alert system. So that's the little window here. Things are even color coded, which makes it nice. Before I take the active, I'll complete this checklist. Haste makes waste in flying. So we, we're not hasty. We take our time. So I'll pull up here. No rush, set my brake. Okay, cast messages are good. Honda Jet, zero Delta Charlie, wind 300 at six, turn left heading 190, runway 23 left, clear for takeoff. Right to the wind and left turn 190 for zero Delta Charlie up on takeoff. Uh, zero Delta Charlie, clear for takeoff. All right, so we've set our heading bug. 190. One Julia Tango, contact departure, see you. And he's cleared us for takeoff. Departure, one Julia Tango, thanks. Station two, Charlie Julia, wind 290 at five, fly runway heading, runway 23 right, clear for takeoff. Runway heading 23 right, clear for takeoff, number 442, Charlie Julia. All right, we're clear for takeoff. Holding brakes, and we're gonna go full power before brake release. Let the engines pull up, and they have. Here we are, nice long runway. And we hold the center line. Speed's coming up. Hands on the throttle until we get past V1. And there's V1, and there's V rotate. Hand comes off the throttle. Two good engines. Nice Two Charlie off. Juliet, you uh, uh -huh. broke up there. Say again. Okay. Okay. Gear comes up. Number two Charlie Juliet, maintain power. Out. 5,000, And flaps come up, and we'll start our turn. Now going up to 5,000, and starting the turn. She is climbing like a banshee. Number zero Delta Charlie, contact departure, see you. Over to departure, zero Delta Charlie, good day. Which freaks? No, we're, looks like we'll be following the highway uh, westbound. Okay, still climbing. Table one, uh, Greensboro approach, Roger. Uh, Greensboro approach, Polonis, November one, Charlie Whiskey, fourteen for thirteen. That's one ninety. Hand flying it for a little November practice. Number one, Charlie Whiskey, Greensboro approach, Greensboro to me, two nine or nine or four. Two nine or nine or four. Oh, one, not bad. A little bit. What? Hello, departure, Honda Jet 430 Delta Charlie, 3,600 feet for 5,000, assigned heading uh, 190. Honda Jet uh, 43 Delta, 430 Delta Charlie, Greensboro departure, radar Speed contact, target. climb and maintain 8,000. 8,000, zero Delta Charlie. All right. Number zero Delta Charlie, turn left, direct Genie. Direct Genie, zero Delta Charlie, thank you.
So just before we enter the clouds, I'll be putting on my uh, heat for the engines. And if the, the plane is smart enough, it detects ice, it heats up the wings and uh, really hot so that the uh, ice doesn't even stick. Delta Charlie, contact New York approach one two four correction one two zero point zero five. Two zero zero five zero Delta Charlie, thank you. Two zero zero five. Hello, New York, Connie Check four three zero Delta Charlie eleven thousand one hundred for seven thousand. Number 430 Delta Charlie Nick Fush, descend to maintain 4000, ice up altimeter 2965. 4000, 2965, and any chance you don't have to drag me all the way out to Calvinton, maybe Deer Park? Negative, sir. Uh, once you're out of uh, maybe 6000, I'll have a turn for you. Thank you. Nine three, nine three, hotel Fox Shot. Sure, nine three, hotel Fox Shot, altitude, discretion. Altitude, out of discretion, nine three, hotel Fox Shot. I'm going to go into the clouds, so. Engine heat is on. Delta Charlie, turn left lane 330, vectors to your park. 330 for Deer Park, 0 Delta Charlie, thank you. Landing mode, 330, okay. Gave him the descent he wanted, he gave me the direction I wanted, that works. Now we can skip ahead to Deer Park. Flight plan. into the clouds. This is Number what we do. We're going proceed direct to the airport, join the left down in runway 3 to left, contact ice and tar, 119.3. Good, start slowing her down too, a little bit. All right, here, Vita, let's check one now. Ice Number is six, detected. You can uh, proceed direct to field, enter midfield left down in runway 3 to left. is so smart, detects it, turns uh, off the DI uh, systems. Uh, Number 6, check Romeo, contact ice and tar, 119.3. Contact 119.3, Six, Romeo. Yeah, we're breaking out the clouds. Remember, 129, Alpha Foster traffic, uh, half mile south of your position, Skyhawk notaring at 2,600. Look for that traffic, 129, Alpha Foster. Remember, 903, Hotel Foster traffic, half mile north of your position, Skyhawk notaring at 2,200. What traffic, we have Kilo, looking to head back to ISIS for a false map, please. Remember, 903, Hotel Foster, Roger, you can proceed first straight in, runway 3, 3, left. Proceed straight in, 3, 3, left, 903, Hotel Foster. Traffic in sight, 129, Alpha Foster. I'm going to 9 of the flush, Roger. And traffic inside as well for 9 or 3 of the flush. Okay, I could turn off the engine heat. We're out of the precip. Still says ice detected. Oh. Nah, it's not detected. We're out of it. Said that's not detected. I was just a little bit ahead of it. Still a warning advance, we'll clear that. Okay, bring in some power. But we do want to slow it down. And for zero Delta Charlie, I'll request the uh, uh, Route Nav uh, 3 2 approach into Farm 2. What is the RNAV 3 2? Yes, sir. And that was for uh, zero Delta Charlie? Yes, sir. So if you want to send me to China, that would work. I just stand by. Start slowing it down. We're not far from the airport. Remember, zero Delta Charlie, proceed direct China. Very good. Direct China, zero Delta Charlie. Thank you. Remember, zero Delta Charlie, to send 18, 3000. Contact approach 125.7 today. 25.7 on the frequency, 3,000 altitude, zero Delta Charlie, good day. All right, let's get that going. New York departure, 734, Quebec Zulu, passing 800. Seven. Thanks for, thanks for that. Hello, New York, Honda Jet, zero Delta Charlie, uh, direct China now. Uh, we're going to do the, the route now, 3-2 approach, and uh, 3,400 feet for 3,000. 430 I'm sorry, Mr. Vett, Kilo, uh, Kilo Z, it's out 7968. I have information, Kilo, and, uh, yep, yep, got it. Zero Delta Charlie, very good. You fired from Sean, across it at or above. 2,000. I don't have three, two. 
I don't know, 2,000 cleared for the GPS 3-2 uh, approach there with nothing, Charlie. Thank you. And New York, good afternoon, Northeastern 700, 2.3 for 3,000, heading 010. Northeastern 700, departure, radar contact. Proceed direct, Kennedy VOR, oh. no left turn, resume navigation, climb to 6,000. It's supposed to be 4,100 feet, but JFK it's VOR, a little right, bit lower. Not bad for us, but good trick to trick the student pilot, right? Zero knots at Calverton with the Yankee. Jetlow 44, expect ILS 31 right. 31 right, ILS 4, expect the Jetlow 44. Uh, you got blocked there. 35, minor for the see ya. Very good, bye-bye. Okay, coming in to 2000. Uh, now we're finally out of the ice again. Uh, 436 at 9, you should be on 2812. The power. 2812, just blue, uh, 436. Coming to 2000 or direct China. 44 to set up 18, 900,000, off to 2,900. Go. 2,900, 6, 900 to send altitude 900,000, jet pool 44. We're intercepting China, and now we're coming over, going to Tracy. Okay, I'll bring an approach plate for everybody's edification on this side. And there we are. Got power standing by. And you're seeing the beautiful Long Island coastline out the pilot side window uh, is Fire Island. And straight ahead is uh, the Fire Island Lighthouse. And to the right is Long Island proper. Long Island Vertical track. is an island. Wow, look at all that traffic. Looks crazy when you zoom it out, right? That's New York. Zoom it in, six mile ring would be good. All right, airspeed looks good. Bring up our checklist. Ah, there's Republic Airport. And uh, Honda Jet uh, Zero Deputy Charlie, runway inside, frequency change please. Yeah, that's Charlie, sure. Uh, Tower 18. Have a good day. Over to Tower Zero. That's Charlie. Thanks. Hello, Republic Honda Jet 430 Delta Charlie. Coming home with information kilo inbound on the uh, GPS 32 approach just past Tracy. Honda Jet 430 Delta Charlie, Public Tower. Hello, welcome home. Wind is 31012, gust 19, runway 32, clear to land. Roger the wind, clear to land, thank you. So, the wind is, it's out there, mostly down the runway. Uh, see the plane is the autopilot is correcting to the left of the winds coming from the left. Zero, zero, two, two. I'm going to take over pretty soon. Uh, a little gusty there. You can see it in the airspeed. Gusty, though, you won't carry a few extra knots until the end. 500. That's 500 feet. A little bit of power. See, I anticipated that. I knew that when we change as I get closer. A little bit of power. Power management. Or really kinetic energy management. Minimums, minimums. Okay, autopilot kicked off. Gear is down, we're full flaps. Fire up with the runway. Well, not completely though, because of the wind. Could be working the rudders. Okay, power's coming out. Okay, it's be rough. State 49, please see change proof. Kick the rudder. Nice smooth landing on a beautiful day to fly. We covered over 450 miles in an hour and five minutes. You gotta love it. As we roll out, I just want to reflect on what a beautiful flight that was. I hope you get the opportunity to fly with us. We certainly make it easy. When you're looking for real estate sites, we get you home for dinner.